Hey guys, welcome back to Auto Repair guys. Today we will show you how to remove and replace front bumper cover on Mercedes CLK W208 guys. This is the thing I'm talking about. Right here, we have more than 100 videos on that model and many more to come on other Mercedes, other vehicles as well. So please subscribe and let's uh, grow the channel together guys. So you need to check the car up in the air, the front end, and we can start uh, with the next step now. So we have the car in the air now. We're going to remove the front tire. Okay, perfect, like that. So this one is out of here now. Next thing that we will need to do, we will need to remove that plastic piece right here. Okay, so now with that uh, trim removal tool, we are going to remove that clip here, okay? And those tend to get stuck, you need to pull the center piece out and then the whole clip. Next guys, we have a few 10 millimeter nuts to remove, okay, you will see now. One towards the back. Okay, plastic nuts right there. And we're supposed to have on the bottom two screws with another plastic like this one there. But we're missing it. Okay, so let's see if we can just pull it out enough. So I'm under the car now guys and there is a hidden, a hidden nut right here that we need to remove with a 10 millimeter with a long extension okay you can see what I'm talking about it's right here okay so this is a done deal now you see, we can pull it over the back. You don't need to remove the whole thing. If you want to, you can, but you won't need to. So, what we got done here on this side, guys, exactly identical thing should be on the driver's side, on the left side. However, ours is smashed, you know, we got it smashed. So, here, we have a little bit of a problem showing you, but again, I mean, it's identical. You need to remove the fender liner here underneath so you can reach towards the front of the bumper and you'll see why also right here now there is a ball that we need to remove with a 10 millimeter remember the same thing on the left side okay you can see all the rust that's been built up there. Okay, this is the ball I'm talking about. It's loose now, right here. Oh okay, yeah, so now there is one bolt. Okay, hidden bolt right here, long, long bolt. Okay, check it out, that's what I'm talking about. Okay, this bolt right there. Okay, so we need to get it loose like that, drop it down as much as you can. And remember on this side, you're supposed to have one more, but it doesn't have it because this one is broken. You have one board like that. Now with the 8 millimeter, we're going to remove all those bolts holding the bumper here. Okay, perfect. Oh okay, yeah, so you think you're probably done, but you're not yet. We need to get a 13 millimeter and there is a hidden nut. Okay, right there, you can see in front of the condenser by the headlight, 13 millimeter nut like that. And there is one on this side as well. So you need to remove, remove both of those. And I think once we do that, we should be able to pull it out. 
it's been a while since we removed one of those but it's all the traditional bumper removal process there is a few hidden things on that and this one actually has a bigger washer as you can see that's what's supposed to look like and this one was replaced by somebody in the past 20 year old year 20 year old vehicle guys and okay and now we need to disconnect the wires okay for the park lights you twist them like that okay and pull them out we have the wire here for the fog light press down pull the lid okay and now let's see how we're going to pull that thing out actually i think we'll be able just to pull it out from here and you disconnect guys those uh, fog lights okay you need to spread those things out okay like that spread them out you're going to pull out next we need to pull the wires remember which one goes where okay and now we need to feed them through the hole here one by one somehow we might need to remove that plastic piece too and we just realized that the uh, big plastic uh, wire will not go through so you can disconnect it actually right here we'll still remove it like that so you can guys see it a little bit better okay this one is stuck really good i don't think it has been removed for a while no okay it came loose so now we can just leave the wires here and later we can push them on and we'll need to do the same thing to this side as well we'll need to disconnect the park light here okay and this one is even broken as you can see and disconnect the fog light okay this fog light is disconnected now too so that's how you guys remove or replace the phone bumper cover on clk thank you guys for watching please subscribe and see you next time